Hey guys, I'm SKV and you're watching SKV Plays On and welcome to another video of Warframe. If you like this video, please do give it a thumbs up and if you like it a bit more, please do subscribe to my channel and without further ado, let me get straight to the point. It is part 3 of the riding, oh not riding, Rising Tide. Why do I always mess that title up? Rising Tide Quest. Uh, this is part 3 of it and I just now got an inbox uh, mail or message from Cephalon Sai. It's the same thing that's written here but he likes to read it out loud so check it out. Propulsion restoration complete. Void breach residue identified on Lua. Probable nacelle location. Recover if viable. Right then, that's the message I got and we are headed out to Lua, but before I do, I need to make sure I have some uh, uh, Warframe that does a lot of DPS or crowd control at least. So I'm kinda gonna take uh, Neja. I mean, I know he's not the best, but I do like the way he puts up spikes in the ground, so I'm gonna take Neja right now. And of course, I'll take... Um, yeah, we'll take the Ignis just for extra crowd control with the weapon also. I mean, I have my static core, but still. And of course, my max range uh, Tonbo. That should kind of help out. Who's a good kitty with bat wings for ears? Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Let's go. Too much affection. Ooh, those eyes though. Anyways, here we go. Uh, we're going to navigation. I'm gonna put it to invite only and then let's go. We have to get the third part now and probably it's the same. I have to defend it and then after that I have to come back to my dry docks in the dojo. Then I have to fit it in and then he's gonna tell me it needs repair. I need to go get some resources. This time I'm not gonna get caught up by that lich because he doesn't own this area so I'm not gonna lose my resources hopefully hopefully Railjack Nacelle nearby locate and assess that's new that part never broke down on the right side this usually falls off all the time that rock I could have gotten Wukong, but other than him moving fast, I need some good amounts of running faster. What? The? I don't really use too many uh, sprint mods for this, but. I like the max range abilities of this thing and also the strength on this. It's pretty decent. Neja and of course. What the? I couldn't teleport? That's not right. Not right. Ah, oh, which way? Oh, this is it? What? I, I would have never guessed. Okay, let's do this. Again, you know what? Back to work. Yeah. Let us get this over with. It's been a while since I used Neja. I should probably make it a bit more of a have established a dampening field. Eliminate them to resume scan. Yes, yes, going for it. Relax. That one. Return to objective. 
Got two. Here we go. And again, this time also probably I may have to clear them out to resume scan. Where did these guys come from? Try something different. Yes, yes, I know. Way too many interference drones I'm getting today. Just because it's the third part or something? Did I have to come with a team here? I hope not. Where is this thing? Yep, almost done. There we go, done. Extract. I really like that teleport. It's a very different way of teleporting. Oh, we got it. Port nacelle. That's what it was. Okay. I think this one probably comes in handy for some kind of a warp drive or some kind of, I don't know, space dive. I don't know how you say it, but here we go. You are needed in the dry dock. Yes, yes. I know I'm needed in the dry dock. Now then, uh, switching to Necros, obviously. I'm pretty sure I need to farm resources, extra resources. So, getting Necros. And then changing it to public just in case. And then uh, going to the dry docks, which is in my dojo. There we go, and uh, dry. Oh, my teleporters are, I mean, transporter uh, devices are ready in the dojo. So, dry dock center, left and right. I have go to center. Bam! I'm here. Oh, what? Wait a minute. What is this? And who put a backpack on my shuttle? And, uh, Uh, it's not even a... It looks like a backpack or a water bottle holder kind of a deal on my shuttle. Anyways, I wonder what this is gonna look like after I fit it in. Here we go. Oh. Oh, it's got wings. Zada plots a data gathering lack around the worm ship. Sukin targets exposed launch orifices. Power redirects to the Tunguska capacitor. With a pull of the trigger, we will end this. Wait, why does it have only arrived. on one side? The moment. Oh, arrives. look at that. Carbides. I have all and the resources today. Precepts. What? That should I be. I am not a viable command cephalon. Oh, I come will on. Continue my search. Continue repairs. Yes, yes. He keeps talking like orders. Reconstruction. Begins. Sh just shush, man. Every time, he just keeps talking and talking and talking. It doesn't stop. I and we thought Ordis was the chatty one. Anyways, that's about it. I guess we gotta wait another 12 hours. So this was pretty quick of uh, part three, I would say. Anyways, that's about it. And seems like I don't have to go farm because I already had the carbide. Since I got it back yesterday from that crazy person who stole it. <laughs> Anyways, again, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys for the part 4. This was actually pretty quick and very short. And kind of sweet. No, nah. Anyways, that's it. 
and you guys have a good day and as always keep smiling i'll see you guys for part four until then a eh, sayonara a eh, tata a eh, see you and a eh, bye bye i'm done for this video <laughs>